but we have a confirmed tornado on the ground near Brule. This is from weather spotters moving east at around 30 miles per hour. And we do continue with what is still a very significant couplet here around Lake McConaughey. So I'll point these out. So you've got one here and you've got one here. And the one over Lake McConaughey is more significant right now. The northern side of Lake McConaughey compared to the one here around Brule, that one looks more impressive. But we have a confirmed tornado on the ground near Brule moving east at around 30 miles per hour. So again, for those of you who are expecting to see the six o'clock news, again, my apologies, but this is our, this is our policy. And this is why we try to stay on the air as long as possible for when we go from what was a radar indicated rotation tornado to now a confirmed tornado on the ground. People in Brule, you should already be in your safe place. Ogallala, anyone within these polygons here, you should be seeking shelter. I keep saying it to anybody out at Lake McConaughey, if you know of anybody out there, hopefully you've gotten a hold of them and they've already taken shelter. Uh, but again, seek shelter in the lowest level of your home and put as many walls between you and the exterior of your home that you can. Okay, uh, maybe an interior closet, maybe a bathroom, something uh, to that effect. If you have a basement, what was that? Can we get to Nathan Moore? Oh, can we take, um, actually, I'm gonna try it here. We're gonna see if I can pull this off. Okay, holy cow. Dave, thank you. Yep. Okay. This is from our storm chaser, Nathan Moore. He has been on these storms from the get-go. He sent me footage of it. I'm gonna try to see if I can get his exact location currently. So this is what he's looking at right now. This is live footage from our storm chaser, Nathan Moore. And that thing is spinning. So again, we have confirmed tornadoes in the western part of the state. We have tornado warnings for Perkins and Keith counties. We had a confirmed tornado reported around Brule, moving east at 30 miles per hour. Okay, our storm chaser, we're looking at his feed right now. Are you kidding me? There's a tumbleweed. I love right it, across. I know. Are you kidding me? How wild. Uh, okay, he is Highway 61, just north of Ogallala, looking west, southwest-ish. So that, this would be the Brule storm, I believe. I believe he's looking at the Brule storm. And you can just see lightning there, but just, you can, here's your real area of concern. Okay, a little bit here too. Ooh, sorry, I'm watching the feed. That one actually, <laughs> that startled me a little bit. Again, is that, this is our is that a funnel? Chase. What was that? Is that a funnel? Possibly Try got it. one form in here. No, I want to point out, notice what I just pointed at is now gone. Mm -hmm. That's what happens a lot. So you had one trying to get going, it dissipated. Now you've got a new area of concern that's trying to get going. Again, this is our storm chaser, Nathan Moore, who is out, uh, he said, just north of Ogallala, looking out to the west. Ogallala, you should be seeking shelter. You are in uh, the path of this tornado. Okay. Oh, Every time lame. I want to duck away from this, it starts to, look at this. Yep. And just to the left of it. Yep, yep, right there. And look at this one. Every time I want to duck back and go to radar, okay, he's switching positions now. Okay, we've got a watch update. Okay. Every time I want to jump away and show you radar, um, yeah, look at that. There you go. Wow. Okay, we're going to go back to radar here real quick, real quick, and then we'll, we'll jump back. Okay, so we have tornado warning here, kind of on the northern edge of Lake McConaughey until 6.15 Mountain Time, 17, 15 Central Time. This is where our storm chaser is looking. That's the video we were just seeing, okay? So we'll switch over. We're looking at this area here. Oh, it's getting stronger, Tim. Right around Brule, okay. That's a strong funnel. Okay, let's go back to it here. Oh, now it's going back up. Now, Dave, 
Come on. I'm sorry. Come on, Dave. The one on the left was okay. was making a real good effort. What? It's still there. Yeah. Okay, we're going to stay on this for a while. Again, this is our storm chaser, uh, Nathan Moore, who is out around Ogallala bringing us this footage. Boy, it's trying really hard. I mean, this one here. Yeah, that was the one that was halfway down to the ground. Mm-hmm. Again, this is a radar, uh, excuse me, this is a confirmed tornado for Keith County, including the town of Brule. Ogallala, you are included in this. You should be seeking shelter. Lowest level of there your home goes again. lightning is sharp. Here it goes. It's it's trying. There's your funnel right there. Two of them. We have two, well, this one's dissipating again. Boy, this one here. You see them zooming in a little bit on it. There's your funnel, and this one's still trying. This one's just kind of the more dominant one right now. This is live footage southwest of Ogallala. And here's your new update. A tornado warning remains in effect for north central Keith County. That's for the northern storm. This is radar indicator rotation on this one. We are looking live at a developing, well, this obviously right now is a funnel, two funnels here just to the west southwest of Ogallala. This one seems to really be struggling. This one, not so much. And you got something to keep in mind, guys. We can't see. Oh, looky here. Looky here. Yep, there it goes. There it goes. I was just going to say, you can't see it. There's your touchdown right there. It's, it's roping out already. It's brief. But that's, that's, and now look at that. Look how fast that's dissipating. Look at that. Wow. Now, we got to watch it all the way, okay? It's dissipating all the way to the ground. But sometimes, just because you don't see the entire funnel doesn't mean it's not there. But that, well, there you go. Again, this is brought to us from Nathan Moore, live footage out just west-southwest of Ogallala. Ogallala, you are in a confirmed tornado warning. You should be seeking shelter. Lowest level of your home, away from any doors and windows. Uh, again, if you have a basement, that's where you want to be. We're going to head. We're going to head back over to radar here real quick, while Nathan's uh, repositioning himself. This is just a nasty cluster of storms in the western part of the state, North Platte, western half of Lincoln County. It's headed your way, okay, and. With the way the atmosphere is, we're probably not talking about a situation where these are just going to suddenly fall apart, okay? We have a tornado on the ground. This is our storm chaser, Nathan. I'm trying to get out of the way. See if he can get that frame back in. That looked like a, that certainly looked like a tornado on the ground. This is our storm chaser, Nathan Moore, who is out chasing for us in the western part of the state. Okay, this, boy, I'm just going to, I'm not going to point at things, guys, okay? Um, I keep forgetting it's not my, my map, okay? Uh, but he had what appeared to be a confirmed tornado earlier near Brule, and now um, we're going to try and get, oh, we're losing, okay, come back. Again, Nathan Moore providing this with us. We are very grateful for him. He's done such good work for us. Um, see if we can get past these hills here and trees and see if we can get a good shot of this. Boy, that, that certainly looks like one right here. That certainly looks like a confirmed tornado on the ground there. Now, last check, I think he was in Perkins County but, or in Keith County, but I'm not for sure. I'd have to double check, but I don't want to. Oh, wow, there it is. Okay, there it is, a confirmed tornado or at least a very lengthy funnel, but this is in the western part of the state. Again, Perkins, Keith County, you guys have got to be um, seeking shelter now. What appears to be a tornado on the ground in the western part of the state here. Again, I don't know his exact location, um, whether he's in Perkins or in Keith County. Okay, three minutes ago he was near Paxton. Okay, so he's near Paxton. 
So we've got a tornado on the ground. There it is. This is live footage from our storm chaser, Nathan Moore, out in the western part of the state uh, near Paxton. And we have had numerous tornadoes confirmed from this complex of storms. And if you live in Northern Perkins, if you live in Keith, if you live in Western Lincoln County, you need to be seeking shelter, okay? Keith County's been hammered by these storms. If you live west of Ogallala, you're okay. Anywhere east of Ogallala, you need to be seeking shelter. Again, this is live footage of a tornado on the ground. This is looking west from Paxton. And this is our storm chaser, Nathan Moore. So if you live in the western half of Lincoln County, this is what's headed your way, okay? Western half of Lincoln County, we have a, you know, Grant, you're under a confirmed tornado warning, Perkins County, and Keith County. So those are the three areas of concern right now. Western half of Lincoln County, and kind of the eastern part of Keith County, and the eastern part of Perkins County. You can still see the tornado appears to be on the ground as we continue to look at live footage. You can see the rotation. Yeah. And for those of us here in central areas, this line of storms is eventually expected to head our way. Now, by the time it gets to us, we should lose a little bit of the tornado thread and be more of a straight line wind thread. Um, but we've got a thunderstorm warning ongoing right now that could have 80 mile per hour winds, if not higher in it. So the, a very dangerous situation unfolding in the western part of the state right now as we have another confirmed tornado on the ground. This is from, again, Nathan Moore, storm chaser near Paxton. It's hard to see it all the way up. I mean, you lose it a little bit there, but you can clearly see uh, right there. So yeah, again, confirmed tornadoes on the ground in the western part of the state. 